She just wants to be beautiful, she goes Unnoticed, she knows No limits, she craves Attention, she praises An image, she prays to be Sculpted by the sculptor Oh, she don't see the light that shines so for today's video, I'm going to be showing you what I keep in my school bag. I did one of these right before I went back to school in September. So it was very empty and I wasn't sure if I need everything. But now we're kind of like halfway through the year-ish. Um, so I thought I would do an updated one. The bag is still the same, but the things inside have slightly changed. I now actually have books and I've taken some things out and I've put some things in. So I thought I would just show you what I keep in my school. You see me looking this way a lot, it's because I'm one away from reaching 17,000. So currently got like the live count going. So like I said, my bag is still the same. It's just this bag from H&M. I think this was like 30 pound at the time. And I remember literally every single YouTuber ended up buying this. I bought this quite like far in advance before all the videos came out. Um, but this is a really good bag. I did have the long strap on, but now I've kind of taken it off because it was annoying me and it's like dragging me down because my bag was fairly heavy um so yeah it just looks like this it's got two side zips and then a main section which is what i'm gonna start off with so the first thing i have in my bag is just my school ipad it just looks like this it's an ipad air 2 um it's just in this case that the school provides on the weekends i do usually take it out of this case and half term and things into an, a lighter case that i've bought myself um but as it is Saturday morning and I just haven't had time to take it out and I knew I was filming this video I just kept it in the case really so it just looks like this this has like all my work on and everything like that I love this iPad except for the time it lost all my media work um, but it's okay now I've learned to love it again so yeah this is just my school iPad and this in the case is really heavy when it's out the case it weighs nothing this case just adds on so much weight next thing I have is just this folder this often has the school books I need for the day this is just like a blue folder and then I've just put a couple of books in here just to show you obviously it's a weekend so I don't need any books but I'll just put Monday's books in so I need like my history book my maths book my French book yeah that's it really um so this front one is just my gcc english literature poetry anthology um the school provides this it's really nice so yeah that's just one of them we've currently done like three or four poems so like this this is just basically what a poetry anthology is i will also often have some form of textbook in my bag this isn't like every day but a lot of the days I do tend to take it. So like I said, I have history on Monday. So I've just put my history textbook in already. This is the LXL GCC 9 to 1 history book. If you are doing um, Weimar and Nazi Germany 1918 to 1939, this is your lifesaver, honestly. This is like the best book ever. It tells you how to answer exam questions. It tells you everything you need to know. And it has like practice questions, interpretations, etc. So it is really helpful. I think this is about... 12 or 15 pounds something like that on amazon definitely worth the money i absolutely love this book i then just have my pencil case this is just a clear plastic pencil case at the beginning of the year i did have like a calf kids in one but eventually i just decided it's easier just to have a clear one so this is just like from wh smiths i think and in here i just have my big highlighter some pencils ruler those funny triangle things that you never actually use in maths but you just have to have with you protractor Rubber and sharpener, glue, pens, my favourite Sharpie highlighter. My Bic yellow one ran out, so I had to find another yellow highlighter, and this is the Sharpie one, and it's just brilliant. Compass, yeah, that's kind of it. If you're wondering, like, where my writing pens are, they're in my blazer pocket. I just keep them in there, and I do have, like, a couple of spares somewhere in here, but I've got about three in my blazer pocket just in case and then the final thing in the main compartment are just my glasses these are just from spec savers and yeah they just look like this if you were wondering i really like these just help me see really um yeah i am short-sighted i think i need them for distance so i think it's short-sighted but yeah i just keep them in my bag and pop them on then like i said there are two zip sections so there's like one here at the front and one here at the back so i'm gonna start with the back one um because that's a more boring one so in here i just have my calculator had this since year seven love it still works really helpful and then in the back 
I also have the English text we're studying. So it used to be Jekyll and Hyde and now it's Romeo and Juliet. I just keep this in here for when I have English. I do tend to this out on the days where I don't have English, um, just to add some less heaviness to my bag. But this isn't very heavy at all, so it doesn't really bother me. And then finally in the front zippy section I just have a couple of things. So the first thing I just have is my Ted Baker spray. This smells amazing. It's a blue one. Um, I don't know if it has a proper name but I just call it the blue one. It smells incredible and it's just perfect to freshen up. And then I just have this little makeup bag. It actually has like no makeup in it. It just has hair bands. I don't even know why this is in here. <laughs> a mirror from Lottie London which is just really handy. Some breath spray because I don't like chewing gum so it's probably a good idea to have that. And there are some bobby pins and things like that in there but this is just really handy. I just pop this in the front. I don't always need it. Um, but it's just nice to know those things are there. If my hair band snaps or... I have smelly breath. That is everything that is in my school bag. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave it a massive thumbs up. And if you're new here, make sure to hit subscribe down below. I don't know if at the time you're watching this, I have reached 17k or not, or we may just be stuck still on one away. But if we have reached 17,000, I just want to say a massive thank you for your continued support. And yeah, I just want to say a huge thank you. I will be doing a giveaway at 20k. I did one at 10k, so I thought I'd do one at 20k. So sooner we get there the sooner you guys get a giveaway and if you haven't already go and subscribe to my vlog channel i edited a vlog this morning look out for that on flora sophia vlogs and i will see you all in wednesday's video bye